watching Lucky Sparrow TK. Yo, what's up, guys? Mike Trout recently sustained the meniscus tear in practice. He was already out for pretty much the, the whole season. So this absolutely sucks for the Los Angeles Angels. They're going to lose Trout for the rest of the season. He's not coming back. I, I hate to hear these things because he was already injured in the first place. And he was practicing and he tore his meniscus in his left knee. So the, the Angels are losing so much right here. They're already playing. They're not playing good this season. They're way above. Below. 500 win percentage. They're not even close to that. Obviously, they're trying to rebuild with Mike Trout out of the rotation. It sucks not being able to watch a player like Mike Trout because he was he's a three-time MVP from 2019, 2016, 2014. Nine-time Silver Slugger. In 2022, he played 119 games and he averaged had a batting average of 283. 40 home runs. So they're losing a lot here. He's arguably one of the best players in baseball when he is healthy. And he's so much fun to watch in center field because he can do a lot for a team. Hitting those home runs, get, getting in those RBIs, getting big knocks. That's what Mike Trout does. He's a beast when it comes to baseball. And ever since he was drafted in 2012 when he won that rookie of the year, such a fun player to watch and not being able to see him and no, knowing he's not gonna, we're not going to be able to watch him until the season is over, until hopefully next season. And I hate to see him injured because he's been injured plenty of times in the past. I hope he, I hope he can get on back on the right track when he's he's back and he can be a beast like he always has. I'm not even an Angels fan. I'm a, a Mets fan. I talk a lot about the Mets on this channel, uh, more so the Knicks actually. He's still a main icon in baseball, and for. MLB fans straight up not being able to witness his spectacular performances it's 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 it sucks it it's devastating because he's such a fun player to watch it's what it is and I feel like he doesn't even get in, get enough credit because he's not out there on the field but you know all we can do is hope for him to come back and let me know your guys thoughts on this meniscus tear the, the angels are not going to be able to win that many games in the season arguably their best player is logan ohapi or even i guess one of their other young players maybe like nolan shanuel i'm not really sure or taylor ward taylor ward is too inconsistent I'd go with Nolan. He gets a lot of hit. Yeah, the Angels really got to do something. And they gave they gave Mike Trout a four hundred twenty six million dollar contract extension for him only being able to play a portion percentage of those games between twenty and twenty one and twenty twenty four. That's absolutely substantial. As long as he could play next season and the seasons after that, it will hopefully be good. But the bad thing now is that he's more injury prone dealing with these meniscus tears uh, hopefully his body recovers quick gets in that good rehab and all that it's hoping for the best of him also mike trout has 378 career home runs he can get back on track the big question people are going to have is if mike trout can finish his career i believe he can finish his career the way he wants when he comes back maybe not have the performances that he would normally have yeah a little worse but that's still great status considering mike trout i, I wish him the best okay well, let me I'm know your guys thoughts right on I don't it know what just and happened i'll there. see you guys next time peace out remember to subscribe but